assalamu alaikum uh, in today's video we will see uh, how to upload and download uh, sew uh, backup uh, from with the help of uh, movie tool software with the help of this movie tool software uh, to connect with the drive and laptop you must have to have uh, software which is a movie tool and communication cable and sew drive so these three things are necessary to connect with the uh, sew drive with the laptop so this is connector uh, communication connector of uh, sew which is uh, which have model number usb double one a now uh, let me show you how to what is the process uh, to upload and download the parameter of the drive and with this uh, with this tutorial uh, you will be able to make a backup of uh, different sew drive uh, on your laptop and uh, you can use it whenever needed this is a movie tool motion studio uh, as i don't have any project so uh, i am going to create a new project select new project and uh, select ok now it is asking me the file name the project file name uh, i want to uh, i want to use so i will call it uh, i mean test sew so and it is asking me the tra target directory uh, and this means that uh, where you want to save i will search my directory i am going to my d drive and i have made a folder which is sew backup i mean test in this i am creating a new folder called I mean test sew select ok and I'm going to choose this folder now uh, it will save the file on this folder on this directory further it is uh, showing the network and click ok now it is uh, now showing me the uh, the first view of the uh, software there are multiple options uh, this is project network window this is a network window and these are these are multiple option which you can access from here uh, there are multiple options and these option can also be accessed from here uh, it will it will show all the options after scanning so as i have connected uh, communication cable and it is it is in COM8 if I disconnect it I have disconnected the uh, COM cable and now I am going to search network scan now it is showing me the error it is showing me uh, there is nothing connected on COM8 if I go to the communication setting it is asking me which communication uh, protocol I want to use I am using serial uh, if I want to add it then I can choose I can do it from here advanced setting basic setting now I am going to connect the cable now it is I have connected and now I am going to search as far as your cable is detected and you do search it will automatically appear all the uh, devices connected with this uh, communication cable so it is searching and you can also see the blinking of the adopter here now now you can see here it is now connected it is now connected and if i go to the 
communication setting it is showing me that I have connected serial edit uh, it is com port 8 which is USB port it is detected and this is the board red I am going to select auto in advanced setting I am not changing any of the parameter click OK and now network scan serial port first you will uh, network scan then you will choose the serial port and then you will uh, do the scan it is not a scanning it is taking more time because I have not power up the drive because and and the, and the software is uh, continuously trying to get the drive but uh, it's failed it, now I am uh, going to power on the drive as you can see here it is power up and showing zero on the display of the drive uh, I will uh, tell you uh, what is the uh, meaning of zero now I am going to scan the network as you can see here as far as the drive is power up and I have scanned the scanned the serial port it, it detected the connected drive so this is my connected drive as far as I uh, click on the drive now it is showing me all the option here for the drive all these options also can be accessed from the from these menus okay. let's suppose uh, if I connect this and I want to uh, choose the connection uh, you can see here the network option also available here it is here also and it is showing here too uh, working with the unit uh, if I want to start up the commissioning of the drive if I want to manual mode if I want to start the motor or stop the motor uh, manually then I can choose this option if I want to see the parameter online then I can uh, choose this option and also uh, other options are uh, available which we will see later manage parameter set you can see here in the manage parameter set there are two options these two options are very useful regarding uploading and downloading the parameter backup first of all very careful uh, in doing taking backup because uh, if anything uh, goes wrong then you will uh, permanently uh, lose the uh, backup uh, you will permanently lose the parameter file of your drive so be careful now uh, first I will uh, upload the parameter which means that I am getting the uh, parameter from the drive and saving it on my laptop so this is the option of upload unit to PC it is used to load the parameter set from the unit to a file also this option can uh, this option is available from here uh, you will right click on this and on the manage unit parameter set you will select also from here I am going to upload it is asking me where I want to save um, I have made a folder I have made a folder of with the name sew SEW backup I mean test I mean test SEW I mean test now here I will choose the name uh, I will uh, call it GF 2806 test this is the name GF 2806 click save and now it is uh, taking parameter from the drive and saving it on my laptop in the file format after uploading uh, I will show you the file 
it is completed now I am going to show you uh, the file where it has saved where I have saved it this is the folder here it is this is the parameter file I mean test gf2806 and this is the project file this is project file uh, <clears throat> I am going to open the file it is readable file you can see the file you can see the parameter you can see the different settings our current setting ramp up setting all the parameters are available here now the uploading process is completed and uh, now I am going to show you how to download the uh, parameter to the drive so uh, we will uh, repeat the process but uh, in different way for before I have choose it choose the upload option from here now I am going to choose the download option from this section this is the download option PC to unit this means that uh, whatever the file in the uh, in your laptop will be transferred to the uh, SEW drive so I am going to choose the file it is asking me from where I have saved it As you can see here, uh, the format of the file should be .vd0. So this is the file of vd0. Select open, and now it is transferring file from my laptop to the drive. And you can sh see here this indicate eight here. Now it is complete. Uh, it is about to complete. now it's done click OK and our task for today is completed so in this way you can upload and download the parameter file of your SEW drive thank you